Okay. Alright, well, well done, Jess. As a personal best of British record to win gold in the 200 free, are you pleased with that performance? Yeah, I'm very pleased with that. If I'm honest, I wanted the world record, so I'm happy with that for now. That's the next target. Just how much pressure were you feeling ahead of that? Because coming into it as a Paralympic champion, yeah, it can be. I felt, if I'm really honest, like, I felt so much pressure. Like, I was so worried about it because like, everyone's going to expect you to win. Like, and I always say, like, never expect anything. Anything can happen. And as well, probably adding to the expectation, was the fact that you've had such a good season as well and you've set a lot of personal bests. Did you try and use that to build your confidence, though? Yeah, I did try, but yesterday I had a bit of an off day, so that kind of set me back a little bit. So I really wanted to do my best that I could do today. And your pacing has been particularly good. It was in the Paralympic final when you came through in that 50 metres and you did the exact same thing today. Is that something that you work on specifically? I, can't have, I hold the same pace and like, I just try. Like, if it's the end of the race, like, you may as well put everything into it. Like, if, you, if you've got enough left, then you put it all in at the end. Well, that, that's finished the first kind of cycle of your season now, and it's and it's finished well with qualifying for the Worlds. Um, how do you approach this next cycle leading up to your Worlds debut in Montreal? Um, I know that I'm going to train very hard, 